What's going on guys? It's Mark from Metcon Engine. And today we have a good workout. We have a lower body engine workout. Okay, so what that means is we're just gonna pretty much target our glutes, hamstrings, and quads. And then at the end, we're gonna do some conditioning, all right, to uh, finish it off. And, um, and yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoy it. Equipment that you need, all we need, I don't see is a pair of dumbbells. If you have a kettlebell, bring it up too if you like. Um, I got my bench too, so if you have a bench, cool. If not, you can bring a chair or whatnot, but it's not necessary, okay? So I'm gonna kind of show you why I need it. But um, you can also do the same if, if you have this right at home or at the gym. Okay, so before we get started, I need us to warm up. So let's go ahead, I'm gonna stand up. And I'm just gonna keep it simple. I just need 30 jumping jacks. All right, so here we go. In three, two, one, let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Okay. Warm up those legs. All right, that's important. All right, straight leg kicks. All right, to get the hamstrings. And opposite hand to toe. All right, so right here. And then switch it up. Kind of just shuffle my legs. One, two, and kick. Good. Let's get five. This is three. And then two more. Good. And then last one. On that left. Last one. On that right. Quarter squat. Grab the knee for a hip stretch. Up nice and tall. Okay, let's switch it up. Up nice and tall. Big squeeze. Switch it up. Oh, today we're gonna have a good one. Good. Let's get one more. Perfect. Last one. Good. All right, quad stretch for the ankle. Reach for the ceiling. Switch it up. Grab the ankle. Reach for the ceiling. Switch it up. Get those quads. Get those hips. Support that knee, grab the ankle. Up nice and tall. Switch it up. Support the knee, grab the ankle. All right, up nice and tall. This is my tight side. All right. Let's keep it going. Good. Good. Let's get one more right here. Last one. Perfect. Okay. Um, hip closers. We're just going to bring our hips. Almost like you are getting those legs over a hurdle. Okay, so just working that range of motion on those hips. Let's go one more each side. Good. Let's bring it back. All right, hip openers. There we go. Good. Good. Up nice. Bring it around. Bring it around. One more. Uh, walking into some uh, hand walks. Okay, so we're here. I'm gonna bring myself to my hand walk. All right, and then from there, we're gonna walk our hands back to our feet, up nice and tall. So the goal here is try to get those hamstrings stretched out. So as I walk my hands back to my feet, I'm gonna keep my legs as straight as possible, and then right up. Two more. Last one. And relax. Okay. Reverse lunge. Take a step back, my right leg. 
from there, I'm gonna do a T-spine rotation, face my right hand, outside left knee. I'm gonna rotate with my left arm. Reach. Good, switch it up. Left leg back, left hand, outside right knee. Rotate. Good. Let's do it again. One more. From there, lateral squat, take a step out. We're gonna drop into the squat. Shoulder, hip, knee, ankle. Okay, aligned. Good, switch it up. Drop into our squat. Good, switch it up. So we wanna make sure we have every plane of movement, all right? We're gonna do a lower body because our body doesn't just move straight, it moves laterally. One more. Good. Okay. All right. Perfect. Okay. So now let's go to our first workout. Okay. So workout. Workouts are going to be um, three rounds. All right. With a forty-second work and a, ten, and a twenty-second break. Okay. So again, we're going to work for forty seconds, take a twenty-second break, and we're going to alternate between two different exercises. The first one's gonna be goblet squat. So I'm gonna grab my kettlebell or my dumbbell, right? And do a goblet, just like this. And all I want to do is squat, all right? We're gonna sit into that chair behind me and then right up. All right, now I've got my bench behind me. All right, just to help kind of make sure, all right, I'm going down low enough I'm gonna to touch and then right back up. So it gives me an idea of how long I can go without going too low and then right up. Okay, now if this is too low, say if you have a chair and that's too low, all right, that's fine. Just go as low as you can that's comfortable for you and then right up. All right, so that's exercise one. Now, exercise two, it's gonna be what we call a B stance deadlift. All right, rear deadlift. So B stance, how I'm gonna position myself is, all right? This leg, left foot back, all right? I wanna wanna, I wanna make sure this leg kind of uh, almost lines up on the inside part of my ankle. I'm gonna squash the bug with the balls of my feet. I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna hold my dumbbell just like this. All I wanna do is hinge my hips back, all right, back nice and straight. My uh, front knee soft. From there, I'm gonna reach towards the front of my shin. Feel that stretch behind that leg, and then right up. Okay, I got right here, and then up, nice and tall. All right. Now we want to make sure we're not squatting. Okay, this is a squat. This is a, a hinge. We're hinging forward and then up, nice and tall. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So those are the two exercises again. Uh, 40 seconds of work, 20 second break. Let's do it. All right, let's get ready. All right, guys, so here we go. We got five seconds, first round. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Gonna drop. Gonna touch that seat behind me, right up. Inhale in. Exhale up. I'm gonna get nice and tall. All right, I wanna make sure. I'm putting all the body weight towards my midfoot to my heel as I squat up and down. Good. 15 seconds. Last 10. And relax. Good. All right. B stance, the left. 20 second break, 10 seconds to go. All right, back foot, squash the bug behind me. Knees are soft. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's hinge the hips and then right up. So you wanna make sure we reach. You wanna keep that dumbbell as close as we can to our leg, okay? The further we come out, the more pressure it puts on our lower back. So keep it close to the body. If you work the back 
of that leg. 15 seconds, looking good. 10 seconds, so you should feel this behind that front leg. And a little back, right, obviously. One more, and relax. Gonna switch it up. Opposite. It's always crucial to work those hamstrings, okay? If we're just doing squats and no hamstrings, that's where injuries occur. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Let's go opposite leg. Up tall. Good. Squash that bug with that back foot. Good. 20 seconds. Proud chest. We're not slouching, right? We're not here. Chest back, chest out, shoulder blades back. Okay. Give the eyes to the ground as you come down. Give your eyes up as you come up. Just want to make sure my spine's aligned, right? That the whole entire system relax. All right. Good. Top of round two. Let's do it. Back to squats. Whew. Here we go. 10 seconds, and then we're off. In three, two, one, let's do it. Good. Now I'm not sitting on the chair, I'm just right, making sure I'm tapping it, pulling them right up, okay? So I'm making sure I'm going low enough and 90 degrees. Right, 90 degrees from my hip to my knee to my ankle. 10 seconds. Almost there. And relax. All right. Whew. What I love about these workouts that is that. It's only about 30 minutes, all right? So no excuse, we get them in, we get them out, all right? To get through the day. Here we go, ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Get these workouts in quickly. I still have time to work and do other things going on in your life, so. Good. Halfway. Remember, we're not squatting. We're just hinging at the hips. The only movement that's work is moving is on my hips, pushing the hips back towards the wall behind me and driving it forward. Five seconds. We're coming up nice and tall. Three, two, one. Switch it up. Nice work. Opposite. Whew. Here we go. 10 seconds. All right, in three, two, one, let's do it. Good, straight down, right up, and go as low as you can, right? You wanna feel that stretch behind the legs. All right, you don't necessarily have to go all the way down here, okay? If you want to, feel free. If you got that flexibility, go for it, all right? A lot of folks don't have that ability to get down that low. So if this is all you got right here to the knee, right back up. To the knee, right back up. All right. Whatever is comfortable for you. All right. With your range of motion. All right. With any type of exercise. Five seconds. And relax. All right. Whew, we got one more round. Okay. 20 second break. All right, there we go. Last 10, and then we're going. All right, three, two, one, let's do it. Good.
15 seconds. Relax, good. Whew. Jump just for a second. All right. Whew, 10 seconds. You ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Hinge. Right up. Hinge. Up. Proud chest, shoulders back. No slouching from the shoulders. All right, squash the bug behind you, so I'm, all right. Squashing the bug with the balls of my feet behind me. Heels slightly raised off the ground. And relax. Nice shot. Opposite. Whew. Finish it out. Ready? 10 seconds. Here we go. And three, two, one. Let's do it. Fifteen seconds. Last ten. And relax. All right, we did it. Three rounds. Okay. We're gonna move on to the next. While we're um, taking a break, I'll give you a minute break. Grab a drink. All right, stretch it off a little bit, and then let's take this one minute break starting in three, two, one. All right, let's go, one minute break. All right, guys, so first workout, all right, we're going to do is going to be a um, single leg squat. So we did a double leg squat. Now we're going to go into a single leg squat. So from there, all I want to do, again, squash the bug behind me. All right, I have my dumbbell, my right leg's forward, left leg's back. I'm going to hold into my dumbbell with my left hand. All I want to do is get into that single leg Squat and then right back up. Okay. Now I'm as I'm as I'm squatting. Okay. I want to make sure my shoulders are oversight my hips. All right. So I'm leaning to the wind and then coming back right back up. All right. So leaning to the wind, up and down. All right. For 40 seconds and then we'll switch it up. Second exercise. I'm gonna grab both dumbbells. All right. We did a single leg RDL. Now we're doing double leg RDL. So feet about. Um, hip, uh, hip to shoulder width apart, okay? From there, all I want us to do is we're gonna hinge, all right, at the knees, back up, hinge all the way down to the shins, back up, so it's a pulse, deadlift, okay? 
for 40 seconds. You guys got it? All right. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's get ready. All right. We got five seconds. Let's get ready. All right. Dumbbell on my right hand. Right leg back. Ready? Let's go. Bring it down and up. Down and right up. Down and right up. Now you can hold on with two dumbbells if you like to make it a little bit harder to add more resistance. All right. I'm going to go ahead and just do one. Just because I had a brutal leg day yesterday. So... I don't want to overdo it today. Good. 15 seconds. Just drop that back knee. Lean to the wind, right? 10 seconds. Good. And relax. Good. Switch it up. Opposite leg. All right. 10 seconds. And we can make these workouts as hard as we want to. Right, so again, you can go heavier if you like, go lighter if you need to. It's really up to you. Ready, set, let's go. All right, if your goal is to burn more calories, go a little bit lighter and get more repetitions within that 40 second span. If your goal is to add more, uh, get bigger, grab more weight, get heavier. Okay. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds. And relax. Good job. All right, pulse deadlifts. Grab both dumbbells. All right. Ten seconds. Knees are soft. Hinge at the hips, all right? Remember, we're not squatting, ready? Sit, let's go. Yeah, I'm sorry, pulse knees, all the way down, right up. Halfway, all the way down, right up. Pulse, pulse, pulse. And relax. Good. That's round one. Let's go into round two. Whew. All right. Let's do it for a second. I'm recover a little bit. Ten seconds. And then we're going. Whew. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Straight down, right up. Now, on that first block, right, we were doing single leg RDL, so almost the same position. But now we're squatting. Right now, we want to squat. So, working more on the quads and glutes in this position, right? First block, we were working all backside. Okay. Our supine side, so the hamstrings, low back, and includes as well. Eight seconds. And relax. Good job. Opposite. Ten seconds. All right, here we go. Three. Two, one, let's do it. And dropping my knee as close as I can to the ground without touching. Now, again, your range of motion is your range of motion. So if you can't get down the slow, don't worry about it. Go as low as you can. seconds feeling these today Ooh, relax boy oh boy I feel single leg all right 
bottom of round two. Pulls, deadlifts. Here we go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Halfway, all the way down. Halfway, all the way down. So we're just playing a different range of motion with these deadlifts. Okay. Ten seconds. Proud chest. No slouching, right? No around the back. Nice fat black behind you. And relax. All right. Ooh, last round. Oh boy. All right. Here we go. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's do it. Good. Looking good. So, you know, I'm trying to keep these, base, these movements basic for now. Because what I want us to do is, I want you to do is, once you own these positions, once you own these positions, we can go and apply harder movements, more difficult movements, right? But for now, let's work on these movements. Let's own them and relax. Good. I want you to own it. And once you get better, move on to something all right, a little bit more difficult, a little bit more civilization, things like that. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, let's go. seconds. Good. Last 10. And relax. Good boy. All right. Pulse the lips. Last one. Here we go. We got three, two, one. Let's go. Halfway, all the way down. Halfway, all the way down. Halfway, all the way down. Dumbbells close as you can to those legs. Last one right here. And relax. Guys, we did it. Three rounds. Nice job. All right. Now we got one more to go. All right. We're going to take a one minute break and then finish off with our conditioning block. Okay. So, one minute break starting right now.
All right, so one minute break is done. Okay. Now we're going into two exercises for conditioning. It's going to be 20 seconds of work with a 10 second break for eight rounds. And we're going to alternate two different all right, exercises. One is just going to be a counter, movement, counter movement jump. So we're going to start from the top, load, explode, and land in the squat. Okay, so we're here, load, explode, land in the squat. The modifications, you're just going to start from the top, load, and then up to your toes. Okay, so again, it's here, load, and then up to your toes for modification. Next, we got skier swings. I'm going to grab my dumbbell, both dumbbells. And all I want to do, I'm just going to swing my hips back, forward, making sure my hands are outside, all right, right next to my hips all right, as I swing. So again, I'm here, it's like a pendulum, all right, with my arms, hips back, hips forward. And then as we swing, you want to make sure we want to overextend in our low back. So when we swing, we're just right here, right here. All right, so again, 20 seconds of work, 10 second break, four rounds. You ready? Let's do it. All right, kind of moving jump squats. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Load, load. All right, reset, ready? Reset. Good, reset. Good, ready, go. Almost there. Good. And relax. Oh, nice job. All right. Whoa, let's go. Some swings. Three, two, one. Let's go. Ski your swings. So, what are you working on? All back, hamstrings, glutes. So, make sure you don't hit yourself, right? Be careful. and relax. All right, round two. Kind of movement. Jump squats. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. Nice. Always landing in that squat, right? So we absorb contact with that ground. Last one. Relax. Ooh, this is tough. All right, bottom of round two. Ready? Set. Let's go. Five seconds. And relax. Oh, man. That was a good round three. Ready? Let's go. Now, if you need a long break, feel free. And then when you're ready, join us. Okay, 10 seconds. These are tough, especially all those leg workouts, exercises we just did. And relax. Ready? Five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Halfway. Come on. Hinging at the hips. And relax. Oh, man. Oh, we're almost there. Uh, uh, last round. Thank God. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. Come on. Reset. Last one. Ooh, thank God that's done. All right, finish it off with these. Oh, and then we're done. Ready, set, go. And 
That's it. Oh, we did it. Lower body engine done. Stay, 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 stay. Onto the floor. Stretch it out. All right. Oh, I'll turn back. Just relax. Arms behind. Oh. All right, pull our knees into our chest. Big squeeze. Good. All right, from there, extend. Left leg all the way out in front, making sure my hip toes are straight up towards the ceiling. Pulling my right knee towards my right shoulder. And then we're switching, let's go opposite. Left knee towards the left shoulder, and I can show my right toe, hips up towards the ceiling. Making sure we're in good alignment, right? That was important. Perfect. Good stretch. Place your right ankle on top of that left knee. Interlace your hands in between the legs. Grab that front knee. If you can grab your front knee, grab behind the knee, okay? Pull right back for a good stretch. I want to make sure this right knee is pushed away from my body. So push that knee away, all right, away from you, your right knee away from you without even holding it or touching it. Just to get a better stretch. Oh man, switch it up. Left ankle, top of that right knee, and the lace your hands in between the legs. Pull right back, push the knee away from that body of yours. Good, all right, butterfly stretches feet together. Jaw, um, put hands on top of those knees, push right down, loosen up those hips for me. Good. All right, from there, extend legs in front. Arms behind, I want you to take a deep breath in through your nose, and then as you exhale up, exhale out your mouth and reach for your toes. All right. Deep breath in. Exhale, out, reach for those toes. Oh, get right in the middle of that camera. Oh. Don't mind the everyday noises of the streets, the sirens. Cars passing by, birds chirping. All right, guys, and relax. Okay, we did it. You did it. Thanks again for joining me. Subscribe to my channel, and then I'll see you for our next workout. You guys have a good one.